stickered it, taking stickers off, it's dirty as fuck right now, but I never, I don't know about you, like, with your drums, and this you Jeez. never clean them, I don't <laughs> clean them, do you clean yours, rarely, oh yeah, I don't clean mine, rarely. unless, if I have to restring the damn thing, then I'll clean it, I like my guitars dirty, and I like the strings, like, I, one of the things I hate dislike, new strings. I hate new strings, yeah, I know. I'm not even like a guitar player. Oh, you, know, you are, but they're they're too tinny. You know, you gotta break the yeah. fuckers in. Yeah, well, yeah, you gotta do it and like stretch them and do it. exactly. You know, and get your like, hand oils on them. Uh huh. Yeah, do you oil your uh, the necks of your guitar? Nope. Out? I never had. You, I've you never should. Done that. You're All supposed right. to for the wood and for your playing. Okay. Never done yeah. that. Yeah. Uh, I worked with a really good guitar player for a minute. He was. He had some issues. I was at Goodwill. Uh, Mark was his name. Okay. And uh, he, gave, he gave me a demo, and he's a really good guitar player. Okay. And, uh, yeah, he that's what he told me. And he took my guitar, and he oiled it up for me. And what kind of oil would you use? Uh, it's it's expensive shit. Uh, <laughs> I can't it starts that. with a T, maybe? Teak oil or tungsten oh, oil? Oh, it might be teak oil. Wow. I don't know. But, yeah, they got it. And, yeah, he... He intonated it for me, and I didn't really know how to do that, you know, with the 12th string. Because mine, like, I can, if I'm in tune up here, when I go down here, I'm a little out of tune. It's like a little sharper. Okay. I forget which one. All right. So, and it's probably a truss rod thing, but I just, I don't want it. Or a saddle, I don't know. But, yeah, you know, he set it up, but I, I sold that guitar. So, but, yeah, he always oils. He's like, it's good for the guitar, and... I believe it is. Because he can, he's one of those guys who can fly up at the top. All right. So he don't do it on a dry, okay. a dry guy. I've never even heard of that. I've been playing those bass for that well. Yeah, well, he is, uh, I don't know if everybody does that. That's have awesome. you ever had to, I've had to uh, go get that fluid that you just have to spray mm-hmm. in your pots because mm-hmm. they get all cracky and shit. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. Potentiometer. Yeah. Yeah. And shit. Greases them up. About to spend eight dollars on a can and use like three shots of it. Right, right. <laughs> it's like, what is? It? Gotta be something you can just buy at Myers that'll you know do it. But it worked. <clears throat> yeah, it's funny because like you made all these stickers. Yeah, like, I remember that. Day, yeah. I had a lot it. more on there. Yeah. The last time I did, the bones, I think, was on yeah, there. Yeah, the I think you had the blanks maybe. Oh, the blanks was on there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. The band we played in together. It's just kind of cool to me because I've had this motherfucker for, for so long and I just held on to it, you know. I yeah, like, Marty's got my first set, of, my first drum. Well, it, okay. he probably doesn't have them anymore. Maybe not, you know. That was sure. a long time ago. Yeah, hell yeah, it was. I mean, I could have thrown this motherfucker in the trash a long time ago. Yeah, but it looks like that would be a goodwill donation or something. Right, go right. right. From an ex wife and keep somebody out of the house or something, you know? But for me, it's kind of like, it's the sentimental thing, you know what I mean? Like, so many people. That defines your musical life, really. You You can. It's like Wardo's Wardo's gone and he came with body. You know, I haven't talked to Vince or Brian Burnham in a long time, but Brian Burnham had me. Vince did the electronics and. You no, know, it's just, it's kind of cool. Yeah. I mean, I'll probably never ever get rid of it. Why not? There's no Why? There's no reason. It's not like, it. yeah, nobody else is going to give you, you know, <laughs> too much for it. I'll be honest think with I you. Think I could, uh, get the buck, I, maybe. Could I get somebody to pay, will you pay $113 for this? That's what I paid for it 40 years ago or 20, 30 years ago. It sounds good. It sounds good yeah. when it works, the input jacks. I mean, for, right uh, you know, for musical instruments, shit. Yeah. That's cool. But, yeah, you I'm just gonna hold on to it. This will be. Yeah, to you, this was priceless. In, this was in um, this was in our earlier videos. This guitar, yeah, this bass yeah. guitar, and I'm playing it and from 20 years ago. Yeah, a long time ago. 
I still got it, my friends. <laughs> my advice, let's cut, because I want to ask you a question.